everyone. My girls desperately wanted to say hi to you guys. This is Rosie. This is Hazel. Oh my goodness, you guys are handful. <laughs> They're being really especially lovey tonight. Say hi. If you've been watching me, you know that I'm a pet lover and I'm also a pet groomer professionally. And I just can't help myself. I have to show them off if they want to say hi. So, okay, we gotta get to work here. Yeah, it's time to say hi to these lovely people. Okay. Oh, I know you went down. Okay, go go see your sisters. Go see them. You can lay down there by my feet. Okay. You want to sit? She wants to sit. I can tell. Well, hi. This is Janice. Welcome back to my channel. Also, if you're new here, hi. How are you? Let me quit squirming here. Today, I'm gonna do my boxy charm, base box and boxy. I got it just the other day, and I finally found some time to do an unboxing. So that's what we're gonna do. So if you're interested in seeing what I got for the month of March 2021, just keep watching. like okay I've been running around today like crazy trying to freshen myself up here let me double check yeah, not bad. yeah. Oh, it'll pass <laughs> all right so if you're not familiar with boxing charm it's a beauty subscription you get five full-size products and it varies from skincare to makeup, sometimes lifestyle, especially in the luxe box. But this is the base box, and this is $25 a month. They also have two other subscription. One is the luxe, and that's every three months, that's $49. Instead of getting this box that month, you will get that one, and you get eight full-size products, eight to nine roughly, and they do include some lifestyle in that one. I used to get that one, but I no longer do. Not because I didn't love it, I loved it. I just have to watch my budget. And the other subscription they have is called the Premium. And you get six full-size products for $35 a month. And they say you get more high-end makeup or skincare. Um, yeah, I get, I don't know. This is just as nice. So I used to get that, but again, it's a budget. Boxy Charm has been with me, in other words, I've been subscribing to this for four years or more. And they've really come a long ways. It's one of my very favorite subscription boxes, so I still have it. Even though you might hear me complain about it, but I I enjoy it. So let's get on with the unboxing. You're going to have to get down so Mama can do this. No, she don't want to. I'm gonna try to do it with her on my lap. All right, this is how it looks on the inside. Well, that's the outside. This is the inside. And it just is like this. You're gonna see some dog hair here. <laughs> and it says, um, hello, Charmer. They're saying hi to us. That's nothing new. They've done that since day one, with, since I've been getting it. They open. They do have a website, and uh, there's a really nice website. It tells you about your products, and you get to review them, earn points, buy products every month. They have either add-ons or pop-up shop for anywhere um, from 50% to 80% off. So she gets some good deals and some makeup. They come with a card every month, a theme. And this month, of course, it's St. Patrick's Day theme. It's really cute. I'm, I'm going to say this for, um, I'm going to do a junk journal. You know, I don't know if you know what junk journals are. My sister's into crafts. She's really into it. She's got a YouTube channel and she does junk journals. I say that, junk journals on it. And that would be really cool to do something with like that. 
and uh, I will link her channel below in case you're interested in crafting. It's really cool. You're gonna have to get down, honey. Okay, no, she won't get down. I won't break her heart. Okay. All right, and on the back of this, it tells me the products I received and explains about the product and what the manufacturing suggested retail price is. And I, what I do is I add those up and see what value I got as far as money. One carry for money. In other words, the savings I got. And we get different variation. Um, the variation this month is so long. They used to be real simple, like a number or two. Now it's C two one zero three zero zero two dash B A. Doesn't mean nothing to me. Doesn't mean nothing to you, I'm sure. It's just it's just that they throw in different products for everyone because you fill out a beauty profile and they try to match you up as best they can of what products they're offering for that month. And for the most part, they do a pretty good job. You know, there's just so many products they have for each month. Okay, honey. Yeah, thank you, baby girl. See you later. Oh, no? Oh, you mad? No. We get to choose one product a month. And you just, they give us a choice of, of th there's three different products usually. And you can choose one of those. Sometimes only a couple products. Time I remembered about it, I always forget. The other choice I wanted, which they were out of already, by the time I remembered to choose my choice, was by Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara. I wasn't too disappointed because I've already used it and I know I love it. So I loved it so much, I wanted another one. But I have enough mascara. So what I chose was from Glow Recipe, and it's the Banana Moisturizer. Now this is also wonderful too. I just have a lot of skincare right now. I'm trying to use it up, and you know, once I open it, you know, I want to use it quickly. But then again, I get excited, so I got a few open right there on my desk. So I'm using those, and. I have tried this already because I got this a few days ago and I was like, I want to see if this smells like bananas. And let Janice take this off. Oh, it smells like banana pudding. That's the inside. It's yellow. And it's kind of a whipped, nice consistency of cream. I like it because it's not real heavy. It's light, which I enjoy. I find if it's too heavy, it tends to break me out because my I don't know I got sensitive I have sensitive skin but I don't have sensitive skin now that doesn't make any sense in other words if I use too thick of creams I, I just don't care for it my skin doesn't like it that's perfect it absorbs quickly and your skin feels really nice and nourished and that's what I like and I've tried that a couple of nights or oh, actually stay cream matter to me. I use it any old time. Anyway, I like this. So that is my glow recipe. And that retails for let me read about it real quick. Glow recipe banana souffle moisturizing cream. A soothing lightweight moisturizer that seals and lasting hydration without clogging pores. It's not allergenic making it especially good for sensitive skin now I just talked about that and it is it's great blended with banana chia seed magnesium turmeric and chia, and chia just said that it's a recipe for hydrated healthy looking skin and it suggests the retail price is $39 that's not too bad it's by glow recipe which is a really wonderful brand okay this Oh, let me show you the box. I just popped it out. <laughs> I, I'm telling you. It's been one of those days. It's by Maven Beauty. I've heard of them. And I can't remember where I heard of them from. But I'm glad 
to get this because I've always wanted to try this brand. Um, it is a rose water setting spray. Do I need setting sprays? No. I get subscription boxes all the time. I get tons of setting spray and all kinds of creams. But do I love setting sprays? Yes. I've used this one time. I'll use it again here and show you. But here's the bottle. It's a bright orange bottle. And the mist is... A little heavy, but you know, it does smell like roses. So if you don't like your rose scent, you won't like this. But I love this scent of roses. To me, it's not too overbearing, but to some it may be. I tend to like floral scents. But if you don't, you won't like the scent. So that is the setting spray. So let's see what they say about it. Set your intentions in your makeup with this Aura Lifting Antioxidant Packed Rose Water Setting Spray Mist all over your finished look to lock it down and improve it smudging for up to 16 hours. And the suggested price is $22. It is a new launch. So this is a brand new product. So that's exciting. Okay, and the next thing I got is by Cab, K-A-B, it's a lip oil. I do enjoy lip oils. I have really dry lips, so all the help I can get is wonderful. It, it, wow, that's huge. That is the tube. It's a blue clear liquid, so I don't think it's going to show up blue. I think it's just more for the aesthetic. So I'm going to just put some on my hand here. Yeah, it goes down clear. See? I already have lipstick on. And I don't want to mess up the doe foot. So how would I do this? Get a Q-tip, Janice? I could do that just so I don't mess up this doe foot. Just to see what it looks like on my lips. Let me... It's just because I don't want to mess up the doe foot with my lipstick. I like putting the ball on first, then my lipstick. But, uh, obviously I can't do that because I already got it on. Alright, let's go ahead and put some on here and just... Oops. It smells good. It smells like coconut. I need it. I got a dark lipstick on, so I'm just dry. I never use the oil after lipstick, so I don't know how this can work. Eh, it don't matter. It's absorbed really quick. Those things are dry. <laughs> so I have a lipstick on, not a liquid lip. But my lips are dry. Here's what it says. Here, let me move this mirror. It's in in the frame here. Get down there. Get on my frame. There you go. <laughs> Trying to be professional here. Not doing a good job of that. But <laughs> Cab Cosmetics Hydrating Lip Oil. Say goodbye to dry and thirsty and hello to juicy hydrated lips. Your lips will love this non-sticky instant burst of hydration that comes in six different tints. Okay, well. I can't tell it tended my lip. Maybe if it was no lipstick on, I could tell. Swipe this formula on for comfortable, juicy lips all day long. And it retails for $20. That's not too bad. It's a nice big size. Okay. And this is unique. I've never seen anything like this before. Well, that's exciting. It's around 10. And it's called the Wet. Brush Cleaning System by Lavish. Never heard of this brand, which is why I like getting subscription boxes because I learn about different brands. And what it is, is a cake of soap. And they do have it in cellophane here. So I'm not going to undo it. I'm kind of smell through there. But you know, it's soap and it's in tin. 
So I'm assuming you wet that down, obviously. What I think is really cool, which is really unique, is I'm not gonna try it on here, but I'm just gonna show you what it does here. It has a, a little rubber thing here, and you can clean your brush. And oh, use that. That's unique. What I like about this is if I happen if I happen to go anywhere and take my brushes with me, I can pop this in my my bag and clean my brushes on the go. Will I do that? Probably not. But <laughs> but it would be handy for that. Or just use it at home like I intend to. Lavish wet brush cleaning system. A convenient brush cleaning system to quickly and easily remove makeup residue from cosmetic brushes. A textured silicone pad stores nicely inside the container and it retails for $15. It's the last thing. It's the fifth thing. And it's by Line Crime. And this is the eyeshadow palette. And it's the Venus number three. And I've heard of this brand, seen this brand out and about. Never owned, never owned anything from this brand, never. Before I forget, go ahead and like this video if you're enjoying it so far and you're getting uh, some help from it. Subscribe if you haven't already. I really appreciate that. I'd love to have you join my little um, YouTube family. How can I put that YouTube family? My um, channel family. I gotta come up with a cute little sayings. Some of these people have really cute little sayings, and I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I just love to have you join me and the rest of us, and uh, just start some conversations. Okay, and oh yeah, also I share this video. That'd be great. It really helps me. What I was saying, I might do a um, decluttering. I may start off with my eyeshadow palettes. I have tons. So this is another one to add to it. I love eyeshadow palettes. One of my favorite things to get. And this is really cool. It has a year. And here is the product. And it looks like it's a pink family. Here are the colors and they're beautiful. And here's what they say. Line Crime Venus 3 Eyeshadow Palette. This palette, this palette is filled with rapturous lilac, rose gold, mauve, and earthy brown tones, shades. The ultra buttery formula sweeps on richly pigmented color that doesn't fade or fall out. The dreamy lavender and rose gold box is graced with Venus herself and the retail price is $38. I got the Venus palette, eyeshadow palette. I got the West Brush Cleaning System by Lavish. My Glow Recipe Banana Souffle Moisturizer. The Rose Water Setting Spray. And the Lip Oil. Decent box. Um, very good box, actually. Very good. Is it my favorite? Mm. There's my dog down there shaking. My chihuahua. Um, uh, it's not my favorite, but it's not my least favorite. It, it's, it's good. It's good. I'm happy with it. I'm very happy with it. In fact, I don't see anything in here that I am unhappy with. So it's a good box, great. So we're gonna go see what the total is here and tell you what the value is. I break it down to roughly, I paid five bucks a piece for these products, being 25 bucks, five divided into 25, of course it's $5. So I'm going to go ahead and add these up. I received $134 worth of products, retail, suggested retail price for $25. Very good value. That's why I like subscription boxes. Not only do I get to try things I haven't tried yet, brands I haven't tried yet, I get a very deep discount. Not to say they also offer the pop-up shops and the add-ons for products that I didn't get in this particular box that I may have wanted. I can go ahead and purchase it 
and then discounted price. And I do that all the time. So, yeah, happy with this box, very happy. All right, everyone, um, that is the end of my unboxing for BoxyCharm. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm kind of, um, I'm tired today. So, I'm a little, you know, all over the place. I've had a long last two days, exciting days, exciting news for me in my personal life, um, slash business life. But it's so in the early stages that I don't want to get my hopes up. So, cross my fingers, pray for me that things that I want to do is going to come to pass. If not, there's always plan B, you know? So I'm in a good space and I feel good and I hope that you are, I hope everyone's healthy out there, still staying safe because, well, we still need to. All right, everyone, I'm going to say goodbye and I will see you in the next video. Bye.